Hi toy fans and viewers, this is Tori on here to review a Funko Hero World Power Rangers Green Ranger and Dragon Zord vinyl figures. And here's what it looks like in the package. It shows Hero World Green Ranger and Dragon Zord. And then Hero World on the top. And it's from Series 4. It's Saban's Power Rangers. It's based on the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. It's only available at Target. And that's what it looks like on the side. The other side. And here's what it looks like on the back. It shows Hero World Saban's Power Rangers. And then it has the Black Ranger, Yellow Ranger, Red Ranger, Blue Ranger, and Pink Ranger. And then it shows Collect Them All of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Core Set, Funko, and other information. And in the next clip I'll show you down the package in a closer view and then I'll give you my final thoughts. And here as you can see is the Funko Hero World Series 4 Power Rangers Green Ranger and Dragon Zord Vinyl Figures 2 pack out of the package. And these two figures are like stylized versions of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers uh, character Green Ranger and what would be called a Zord of the Dragon Zord. Or just Dragon Zord. I'm not sure how you word that but um, anyhow this is the Green Ranger looks really cool nice detail a lot of nice detail very slender built just like the original ones but it's really nice painted detail when you find it in the store this one's got amazing paint detail now this Dragon Zord on the other hand, this one has little paint flaws. But the nice thing about it, it's painted with um, simple paint that you could get at like a craft store to touch up the paint. So like that gold, that wouldn't be too hard of gold to find to uh, repaint. You could probably get that like a touch up marker or something. And the silver paint. You could get a paint marker and paint that part up, or you could sand that and repaint it. But the the eyes are painted nicely, the green's painted nicely, the gold, the red. But there's certain areas that it doesn't have perfect paint on. But it's really nice nonetheless. And it's made of a stiffer plastic, so it's not really rubbery, it's, it's a stiffer plastic. So this is more of like a collector item. Not really necessarily a toy, but for a, vic a figurine this is pretty nice. And for comparison, next to a Bandai Power Rangers Mighty Morphin Green Ranger from their Legacy Collection back in 2016, that's what it looks like next to the Green Ranger. And of course, it doesn't have the detail in the Morpher uh, belt buckle, but still real, really nice nonetheless. It's not completely accurate. And that's what the back of it looks like. And I'll show you the Dragon Dagger comparison. So that's a comparison of the Dragon Dagger with the collector version. So it looks very similar, just not completely accurate. And that's the two pack figures of the Hero World Power Rangers Green Ranger and Dragon Zord. Now, if you can find these in the store still, I highly recommend picking it up. If you don't find one that's perfect, I still say it's a nice set to have just for the Dragon Zord because this thing normally goes for like 80 bucks or more just for the Zord uh, that Bandai produces and um, even the Micro Machine 2 pack just for the Dragon Zord goes for quite a bit. I used to have a 2 pack of the Micro Machine with uh, Goldar and the Dragon Zord and I wish I would have never got rid of it but this is kind of a cool replacement and it's really nice painted up 
And if, like I said, um, if you can go to a craft store and just like find this paint, you can touch these spots up. And it's not like that complicated a paint. Now, I want to go out of my way going online to get this at like a real high price. I would try and get as cheap as possible. And that's all I really have to say. If you'd like to see more videos, be sure to subscribe, leave a comment down below, and stay tuned for more reviews.